so pretty. Good morning, everybody. Let's do another sanctuary vlog. So coming over to uh, feed the goats and the pigs right now. Hi, guys. Hapatunia. Julie, what are you doing, big girl? Petunia. Oh, Petunia. Hi, Petunia. And you like stretches? Yeah. Little butt scratches. Daisy! What are you doing over there, Daisy? You scrounging underneath the goats? Julie! Come here, big pig. Julie! Come here, big girl. Come here. Oh, there she is. Hi, Julie. Oh. What? What? Look how big she is next to the goats. Hi, Daisy. Now I come over and check on the tortoises. So they look pretty happy. Look at Fergus in the house. How are you guys doing? All right, so now it's time to give Olaf his meds. Want cracker? You want cracker? Oh, you want this? You want this? You want this cracker? Yeah. Oh, he's a good boy. Oh, good boy. There you go. That's one. Good boy, yeah. You want another one? A cracker? A cracker? Oh, that's a good boy. Yeah. You want some cracker? Yeah, there you go. Gotta get him to actually swallow it. There you go. There. There's some more. So he's got four different meds we gotta go through here. You want a cracker? Oh, this cracker? Yeah, it's good. There you go. Good boy! Oh, we got another one. Good boy, yeah, you like that? Oh, you like that? Oh, this good boy. There you go. Being so good. And we got another one. Last one. The last one. You like that? You want more? Yeah. Good boy, there we go. That was all your medicine. Good boy. Hi, Sami. Hi, Chunk Skunk. You come to get your bowl, and she just crawls right up in my lap. She's so sweet, and she loves cuddles. Neo. Yeah. You guys believe that she was given up because she was biting too much? Look at this. Look at this animal. Oh, you saw me. I'm being sweet, you know. All right, so now we're collecting all the bowls so we can food prep, feed everybody. Hi, Hazel. Let me get your bowl. You peed and pooped on top of your bowl. That's very nice. I don't know why you like to do that. 
Oh yeah, look at that face. It's a territorial thing, but still. It's pretty gross, girl. Grab the bowls from you guys. Thank you. All right. Oh, that's nice. Now we're gonna collect all the empty Kawadi bowls. Hi, Blanco. Good morning, Jelly Bean. Hi, buddy. Hi, Chloe. Hi, Chloe, Chloe. Oh, hi, Chloe. Hi. Hi, Chloe. Hi, sweet girl. Hi, Chloe. Oh, this Chloe bird. Hi, Cupie. Hi, Cupie. No, oh, Chloe just landed on me. Hi, Chloe. Hi, Chloe bird. Now I gotta wash all the dirty bowls. All right, all washed up and ready for food prep. All right, so now we're gonna do food prep and I'm gonna try my best to uh, show everything I'm doing with a tripod and then just speed it up for you guys. So if I didn't already say it, uh, Gabby's actually out of town on a cruise for the next few days, so I'm on my own. Normally she does all the food prep stuff, so I'm gonna be doing all of it on my own. So let's go ahead and get going. You still on the bowl? You. You guys are so funny. Can I pet you? Nope. Look at that little butt. Look at that little tail. Little knob butt. You guys are so funny. I'm assuming, <laughs> I always do this, you know, I do these vlogs every day, so then I'm like, oh, people have seen the ones I've done before, so they know what these are, and then I get new subscribers, and I'm like, what the heck is that thing? So these are the Patagonian Maras, also called a KV, and so they are a large rodent, uh, kind of cousin of the capybara. They, to me, they're like a guinea pig on stilts. They are so funny, though. All right, food prep's all done, got it all in the back, so now... Taking the golf cart over with everything to uh, go feed everybody. I'm actually going to switch it up and I'm going to be feeding uh, Jet the Fennec Fox and Asami the Skunk tonight uh, because it's been hotter during the day and I've noticed uh, maybe that's affecting their appetite. I don't know. So I'm going to give it a try. You know, uh, they are mainly nocturnal animals, so we'll go ahead and do that. Now it's raining though, of course, but you yeah, know, we're here. Oh, Clovey, you don't like the rain? Look at that sad face. Is it raining? You hate it? Yeah. All right, so feeding the foxes. There goes Kira with the chicken drumstick. Here's Yue, a pretty girl. There we go. She's getting all crazy for that chicken. She's like throwing everything else out of the way. So they got chicken drumsticks, they have carrot, green beans, sweet potato, cantaloupe, exotic canine diet, blueberry, and apple. So a lot of good stuff today, but all they're focused on right now are those drumsticks. 
Here you go, Hazel. It's okay. Just Clover shaking off the rain. Same thing. Take the drumstick and run. All right, so quality feeding time. So we've got uh, chicken drumstick, omnivore diet, monkey biscuit, baby food, apple, sweet potato, uh, carrot, and banana. You guys being crazy. Hi, jelly beans. Here you go. Got some big fat blueberries today. There you go, buddy. So jelly bean is getting blueberry, cantaloupe, apple, and his uh, soft bill pellets. Look at those eyes. So pretty. Chloe is watching the baby emu. Like it is, look, look at her, look at her. She's like, what is this thing? What is that, Chloe? What is that thing, Chloe? What is it? Think you want some food? Come here. There you go. Look, she's more interested in the emu than the food. You enjoying your food, Olaf? Yeah. You being a good boy. I got Bluebird. Hi, Blue. And Rocky. Hi, Rocky. Hi, Rocky. Hi, buddy. Handsome boy, Rocky. Oh, this handsome boy. There's Zazu. And then Petrie. Now I'm in with the prairie dogs feeding them. I got Poppy and Coco climbing me like a tree. Got Big Harv back there being a creep. Hi, guys. Hi, guys. Oh, pop. Nope, that's that's hard back there trying to bite me in the butt. There's Cheeky over there coming out. Here, here, here. Look, look. Come here. Come, come here. Get your food. There's food for you. Go over there. I don't care about the food. I just... All I want to do is climb me. What you doing, Harv? All right, so now we're in the small turret aviary feeding everybody. Time for your nighttime meds, Olaf. Oh, you want to take this? You want this cracker? You want this? Yeah. There we go. Oh, there's a good boy. Good boy. Yeah. Oh, this good boy. Taking his medicine. All right, so we're doing night checks now. All the kawadis are asleep. Looks like they're all inside their boxes. See some little faces poking out. Let's check on the foxes. I see eyes glowing back there. There's Hazel. Everybody looks good back there. Clovey's investigating. There's Jet. Hi, Jet. Got food for you, Jet. Got food for you, buddy. Hi, Jet. Look at this. Oh, look at this. We got food for you. Yes. 
We got some sweet potato and cantaloupe and liver and there's going for the rabbit. Who loves that rabbit? So I'm feeding them at night. Usually we feed them in the morning, but it's been really hot lately. And I have a suspicion that the heat is uh, making him less hungry. So that's what seems to be the case. He is very readily taking his food right now. He's a lot more active at night. I mean, they're a nocturnal species anyways, but when it was cooler out, he was active all day, no problem. But since it's been hot, he's been sleeping all day. But uh, yeah, so he's got some ground rabbit he's going for right there. Sweet potato, green bean, um, cantaloupe, carrot, blueberry, and liver too. Yeah, that's a much better appetite response out of him. So I think feeding him at night is gonna be the way to go. It's just easier to feed him in the morning because we're already feeding everybody else in the morning. But I think this is the way to go. There you go. So I wanna try the same thing with Asami, just because skunks are naturally nocturnal, but domesticated skunks are a bit more diurnal. So I wanted to see what she would do. See if she has more of an appetite at night or not.